farming although a quite mindless task it is very 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 high rewarding because at the end of the day all you're doing is just holding on two buttons or making a shit ton of money and well chat if you know me you know that i love money and well since my exams are coming very very soon and my scabs of election won't be going anytime soon i'm going to max out garden and the fastest and the easiest way to do it is to max out my farming fortune and the way i do it is by spending billions and billions of coins on tiny minor upgrades so let's do it all right so before we start we are going to go ahead and compare the farming fortune currently i have this wheat hoe which is kind of maxed and holding this the overall farming fortune we get is about 1415 point 8 yeah don't don't forget that point 8 and currently if i go and show you my crop milestones i'm almost done with melons and wheat so the next thing i'm going to go ahead and do is probably going to be nether ward so let us go ahead and look for a good hoe i can buy all right so after spending a whole 7 minutes trying to find a hoe i think i really like this one it is cultivating 10 and has over a billion nether wards this gives us about 16 more farming fortune and yeah i mean 148 million I think we're just gonna go ahead and buy it. All right, and now this does require quite a few things to be done to it to max out. So we're just gonna go to the hex and get it done. Now to start off, we're gonna unlock all the gemstone slots. There we go. And as for the gemstone, you know what? We're gonna do perfect peri dot because I can. All right, since I am anyways doing it, might as well do it for the whole armor set. Uh, I'm gonna go and buy eleven. So insta buy is 341 whereas the buy order is 317 mil yeah i'm just gonna go ahead and insta buy it ah uh, there we go that hurt my purse so bad uh, but i mean th this just looks good all right all right head on to the mines over here and i'm gonna go ahead and put all the new gemstones all right i'm just going to go ahead and quickly put on dedication 4 it is very very cheap now 11.2 mil and we are just going to go ahead and remove efficiency 5 because I mean, yeah, th that just looks ugly. <laughs> there we go, that should be maxed. Anyways, time to replace all the gemstones on the armor. Alright, and that is done. We get back 25 mil. That, that, that is not even one perfect. <laughs> It, it, it was worth it guys i mean i mean that just looks good all right uh, and plus four farming fortune per piece y yeah anyways now that the armor is done it's time for me to go ahead and fix my equipment if i just do slash ff in here this is a sky honey mod it tells you the best efficient way to get farming fortune and currently i'm missing quite a lot of farming fortune because of my equipment Green thumb 3 only. Now this goes up to 5 which is kind of expensive but I am missing about 8 farming fortune per piece. Alright, prior recording I just unlocked this Zoroscape. You get this from the chocolate shop and it will be better than my lotus cloak so we are gonna go ahead and max this. Now before I max any equipment out, this will be my farming fortune. 1437 before and yeah, time to buy some books. 224 million coins there we go that hurts so so bad all right and finally there we go green thumb five on my bracelet there we go green thumb 5 on my belt and splash one more titanic green thumb 5 on my necklace there we go and now i just have to do all of that again for my zoroscape more editing great and there we go that is green thumb 5 book and that is the Zoroscape with green thumb 5. Of course, we don't have enough levels. Why would we ever, right? But yeah, there we go. Green thumb 5 on my Zoroscape as well. And that is the full equipment done. Alright, now we go ahead and do the farming fortune test. 
break of you never watch here and before we started we had 1437 and now we get 1369.2 so basically we did all of this for 32.4 farming fortune uh it, it was worth it it was worth it surely now i could go ahead and put on the one enchantment on my necklace but that is like a hundred million coins for like 0 0.8 farming fortune so you know what i'll make a deal if this video gets like 50 likes um yeah I i'll do it sure all right so keeping gear aside there is one more thing we can do and that is by unlocking plots you get three farming fortune more and currently i'm missing about 12 from it so i'm gonna spend a few million all right time to unlock the first plot that is eight compost bundles then 10 and now i need 12 which is like what um se seven more so that should cost about 20 million coins there we go uh th this is taking quite a lot of money but i mean hey it's like 20 sky block xp i'm getting so i mean it's kind of worth it uh and then the final one will cost me 15 compost bundles 40 million coins <sighs> there we go uh that is the whole garden unlocked and cleared now one more thing we can do before testing our setup uh, is to actually max out the crop upgrade shop. Now I already have saved up about 45,000 so yeah enjoy this montage. And finally we have nether wart. There we go 4,000 copper and yep that is the whole crop upgrade shop maxed. Anyways, now that my setup was all ready and good to go, it was time for me to test how much money I could make per hour. Alright, so final gear check. I have this cultivating 10 uh, full perfects, uh, Melon Nicer 3.0. Then I have 3 fourths Lotus equipment with the Zoroscape, all green thumb 5. I also have 3 fourths Mossy Fermento with the Rancher's Boot on Mossy. Uh, and I will be using my Mushroom Cow Pet with 1267 magical power anyways now we're gonna go ahead and farm melons without any buffs and we'll see how much we make per hour all right so after a quick test we should be making about 17 million coins an hour and now we're gonna go and do this with some temporary buffs so we're gonna activate the best hunters bonus and we're also going to drink this harvest harbinger potion which should give me about 50 farming fortune more so in total, I have 1,994 farming fortune. So let's see how much money that can make us. All right. So as you can see in the right hand corner, I should be making about 19.4 million coins per hour. Now this is just an estimate. It can be a bit higher or lower, but yeah, that's the final verdict. All right. Yeah. And that is the end of this video. If you made it so far, thank you so very much for watching. But yeah, I mean, in the upcoming weeks, there will be a lot more farming videos. I'm sorry if I haven't uploaded in a while, I've just been studying and busy with some life things and yeah, I'm just really tired now so leave a like, hit the subscribe button, all that good stuff It's 2am, click a video on the screen right now I'm gonna go sleep, bye bye